Hi everyone! Hi! Hi everyone and welcome on my channel! My name is Linda and today I'd like to share with you guys how I cook spaghetti gamberoni. It's one of my favorite plates and it's totally easy to prepare, so let's go! First of all, I'll show you the ingredients for one person only. Raw shrimps, peeled and cleaned. Whatever pasta you prefer, I took spaghetti. A lot of garlic, red chili, juice of a half a lemon, olive oil, which is heatable, fresh parsley, salt, and a little black pepper. The exact amount will be in the description box below too, so you can screenshot it easily. This recipe is really easy. Basically, you just have to chop the garlic, chili, and parsley as thin as you like and squeeze a half a lemon. If you like it spicy, you can chop the chili as it is. Otherwise, remove the seeds. My tip, cut the chili in the middle along the length and use a teaspoon to peel the seeds out of the chili. It's already getting hilarious how many times I touch my eyes after removing seeds without a teaspoon. I hope you don't have to experience that kind of burning in the eyes. Now all you need to do is mix everything together except the shrimps. So mix it, mix it and mix it until you think the sauce is ready for the shrimps. The shrimps should be well covered in the sauce and when it looks somehow like this, you can put it into the fridge. I personally recommend you to leave it overnight, but if you can't wait, try your best to leave it for 2 or 3 hours, because the longer you leave it, the better will the shrimps taste. The next day. So, let's have a look. I covered the shrimps in some foil so my whole fridge doesn't smell like garlic and shrimps. And the next thing you can do is prepare the pasta. I've got a small kitchen, so I can prepare both at the same time. I start with the pasta and put them to the side when they are ready and start with the shrimps. I will fry the shrimps separately so I get them out of the sauce and put them on a small dish. And then just fry the shrimps. You can see the shrimp is getting done when the color changes from grey to orange. Then turn them around and fry them again but just a little bit. We don't want to have them gummy and dry. Now get them out of the fry pan and add the whole sauce soup into the fry pan. We don't want to waste anything, so I first put the spaghetti into the bowl before I add them to the oil sauce in the fry pan. Rest them for a while until the garlic turns light brown and then it's already time for serving! Okay, people, so let's try. Mmm. Mm, that's a 10. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, people, I will have dinner now. I hope you like this video. Leave it a thumbs up if it's so, and don't forget to subscribe. See you next time. Bye.